guys, I'm Doc Holiday, and I'm back. This might be one of the dumbest things I could possibly do. Open another 2023 Walmart Optic Football Mega Box. I've opened another one of these, and I didn't even bother to upload the video because it was so terrible. Might be a bad decision. Just like Jordan Addison's recent decision to get drunk while he was driving and fall asleep in traffic. Yes, that happened. It's crazy what's going on with these receivers. Rashi Rice, now Addison. We got these top receivers and they're just making terrible decisions. But this has been the season of bad decisions. I just ripped this pack of 2023 Contenders football. This is a value pack. It was horrible. These were the rookies I pulled. I shit you not. Stetson, get out of my packs. Bennett and Clayton Toon. Clifford on there. Not quite as bad, but... I mean, I'm always hopeful for these guys that something will happen. But yeah, you know that's not what I was shooting for. But so are the value packs worth it? No. And one more thing I wanted to talk about. I was going to talk about Brandon Ayuk actually reporting to practice, you know, because he was requesting a trade from the 49ers. Well, obviously he wasn't happy with the $14 million that he was supposed to be getting through his contract, knowing some other top guys are getting, like, upwards of $30 million. But the other thing I want to talk about is in card news, and it's pretty crazy. Now people are using um, CT scanners. Like, they're buying them used. Somebody did this, bought it used, and fixed it up. They're quite expensive, but they can be used, and these guys are using them to check packs for hits. So, I mean, that's crazy. Especially when it comes to, like, you know, if these big breakers or people selling boxes or something. If, if it's if they're big, you know, you got to watch. It's just something else you got to watch out for now. And then I seen how somebody was questioning how some of these packs coming out of Optic... Looked a little suspect. I think this one looks all right, but some of them definitely did. I think that, that might have been Vikings 95 that was pointing that out with the blasters. So I'm not going to go over the box. You guys seen it before. But these are the Blue Hypers looking for downtowns. And these come with jersey cards. I have not seen autographs pulled out of these, even though it's supposed to be an autograph or a jersey per box on average. I'm almost thinking that the autographs out of these are like case hits as well. So we'll see. All right, first pack. Maybe this time I could actually make some first pack magic. Forget about that last pack magic. I don't want to save the big hit till last. I want to get it out of the way. What we want to see is lasers in the background of a card. That almost looks like it could be Saints colors, but we'll see. First blue hyper. Put it on the back. Cunningham. Drake London. Miles Murphy is the first rated rookie. Jalen Hyatt for the Giants and Brian Breesey for the Saints. I should have known Brian, every box Breesey, especially the Walmart mega boxes. And of course, I believe this is thick. At least have it be a good jersey card if it's going to be a jersey card. It is. There's the next blue hyper already. It's Jordan Love. Jameer Gibbs. I mean, I'll take his rookie. I have pulled his hollow already, too. I think it's blue hyper as well. Jackson Smith and Jigba, I'll take that. And hopefully this hollow is Ryan Tannehill. Come on. Dalton Kincaid. I'll definitely take that. I'm happy with that, actually. I am. I'm, I'm really happy with that. I think this guy's going to end up being a great tight end. And with a, you know, injury-free training, um, injury-free offseason this time around, I think that we're going to see great things from this guy. With Diggs gone, and I know the new receiver lineup is going to be pretty stacked. I think it's going to be good, but I think this guy might be one of the go-to guys. I think we're going to see him get targeted a lot more. He's going to step up. I really think so. I'll sleeve him up after the video. I don't got the big sleeves for him right now. That was a PC hit, but now it's on to the next. I still with even just a base Stroud. So is this a hollow rated rookie? Yes, it is. Well, Brian Branch, I didn't mean to put that on the front. That might be my last blue hyper. That's crazy. Unless there's like an extra one or so, or maybe there's a big hit in here. We'll see. Tyler Scott. Tucker Craft. It's like all the same guys in the Walmart boxes. It really is. I 
I don't know, guys. This is this is probably gonna be my last box if it don't get any better. Yeah, not the insert I'm looking for there. Jalen Hurts, play action. Really underwhelming pack with that one. Two left. Come on, I, I need something to happen here. Okay, so that's probably the last blue hyper. I'll save that for last. Maybe there's a hollow in here. These, these feel weird, too. These packs feel weird. I know that's probably just me being paranoid, but I've seen that already. Paris Johnson Jr. for the Cardinals. BJ Ojolari, another Cardinals. Passing grade. I mean, not the insert I'm looking for. Honestly, I, I, I'm not impressed by this insert at all. I mean, I, I love Josh Allen, so I'll just take that and throw that in the PC, but the card itself... That's just like a poorly designed card in my opinion. Oh, this is tough. As can be. But I didn't show you guys the last box, so I'll probably show you the guys this one. Elway. Jake Moody. I mean, whatever. That's probably the best, one of the best things I hit so far. Got Jair Brown for the 49ers, a safety. Not exactly what I was looking for, but I mean at least at least I pulled Richardson there. Just a base rookie. pay secondary price for a Walmart box even if you could get it at 80 because I'll tell you guys a secret here I scored this one at for 80 bucks so bottom dollar resale for one of these boxes because people are selling for a hundred 85 to 100 I got lucky but I mean did I really get lucky you guys tell me because ultimately the Walmart boxes suck big ones at least I got the Kincaid hit too bad it's not like a player worn thing Richardson, I'll take it. What do you guys think? Are the blasters better? I definitely would say the blasters are a lot better, but this stuff was all hard to get. So, till the next time, Doc Holiday guys, I'm going to bed.